You don't know me. Confession I can't take back. I am... The Masked Speaker. Got a text into 78592 that says, I confess to sins I haven't committed. Whoa. Because I just like to stay ahead of the game. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> That's an interesting strategy. Uh-huh. Would not recommend. Yeah. Especially if the cops want to talk to you. Yeah, that's not good. There's no evidence yet, Jeffrey. Well, and it certainly wouldn't work for this segment where listeners tell us about the guilty things that they've done in their past. Mm. One of our listeners is ready to unload some of his sins on us. He's using the fake name Diego. So, Diego, welcome to the circle of sin. Hey, guys. How you doing? Oh, my God. You immediately get the award for best fake name out there. <laughs> People are always calling me like, I'm Ben. I'm like, what? Yeah. No. <laughs> well, Diego, our voice changer is on. You're now the mass speaker. Whenever you're ready, go ahead. What's your confession? Well, um, I, I got to say, first and foremost, I'm pretty pretty proud of this confession. It's, oh. Uh, oh. Okay. Of Do you want us to turn the voice changer off? You want yeah. to just tell everybody? You want to say what your real name is? No, no. We're, we're staying mass here. We're staying okay. mass. So, um, I'm a stand-up comedian. Okay, oh, cool. so you just don't want people to come to your shows? Is that why you're staying anonymous? <laughs> no, no, no. So basically, like, I started doing this five years ago. Uh-huh. I, I wasn't so good at first. I don't mm. think anybody is, right? No, That's no. the process. Dude, I've been doing it over ten years, and I'm still not good, so. No. <laughs> <laughs> glad you said it. You know, <laughs> so, you know, I was bombing a lot, and I almost quit. I wasn't the cleverest fella, I guess you could say. Okay. But it was something I really wanted to do with my life, so I decided to be a little more proactive about it. That's always good, you know, follow your dreams. Yeah. Yeah, absolutely. You know, so what I did was I started going to really small comedy shows, like no audiences. Mm -hmm. Okay. And at these shows, sometimes just one or two funny jokes. And, Uh... you know, you go to enough of them, you hear enough funny jokes, so I just started stealing the jokes. Oh... (laughs) You can't do that. I'm sorry for laughing because a lot of comics think they can do this, especially when they're young in the game. And it always, always, always catches up to you. You steal the wrong joke, it goes viral. Also, people Uh, are like, wait a minute, that's not your joke. But yeah, I mean, Jose's been there, trust me. (laughs) I opened for Carlos Mencia. Everyone thought I was stealing everything. Yeah. (laughs) Wait, do you, have you gotten caught? No, because no one's ever heard these jokes before. I'm telling you, these are like the smallest comedy shows on the planet. Oh, I'm... like open mics and stuff like that. Okay, you're not... Yeah, oh, yeah, exactly. Okay. I think these nobody jokes and oh. I make it into something because I'm successful now. Oh, oh you're successful. Wow. Oh. What, what does that mean? Oh, I mean, like, I'm booking shows. I have an agent. I'm on tour. Oh, man, oh, that's oh. cool. Good for you. But Wow. I know other uh, comics that do this, too, and it, it's always cut up. I just don't uh, understand. If you're successful, why don't you just pay for the jokes, then? That's what, like, the big-time comedians do. They hire a team of writers. Yeah. Like, They'll have other headlines. They may, uh, like, change a couple things, but they're getting, like, a lot of their stuff, if not everything, written for them. Yeah, that's what we do. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Nothing on this show is original. <laughs> well, I mean... I don't pay for it because it's simple. I'm cheap. Oh, okay. Oh, you sound okay. really proud. Okay. Yeah. Uh, At least you're owning up to it. So. I'm in talk to Netflix for a uh, for streaming special. Wow. Whoa. Seriously? Do you feel like you don't feel bad? Are you kidding me? I'm pulling like eight, nines, and tens at this show. At each show. <laughs> Wait, well, bro, that's any that mean... comedian. He's talking about girls. <laughs> oh. You get oh. on stage. I thought people were yeah. scoring him in the no. audience. <laughs> you literally get on stage and girls are just like, wow, I want to <laughs> kiss that guy. Yeah. And that's worked out well for Jose. Yeah. yeah. Well, yeah. they kiss me, then they don't call me back. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and then Jose has to go to the doctor right afterwards. I have oh, an important wow. question. What happens when finally someone calls you out and they're like, no, that was my joke. I was at open mic. He was there too, and I swear I have it. It's on tape. What happens if you get called out? Deny, deny, deny. Deny. Oh, oh, yeah, nice. and I don't know. If you're That's not smart enough to write your own jokes, I don't know if you're smart enough to get away with this. <laughs> <laughs> I don't remember ever going to an open mic. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, watch my Netflix special. <laughs> I have a feeling you haven't stolen any jokes from our show, have you? Yeah. No, certainly not here. I mean, not with Jose in the back. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, uh, good wow. for you. No, no, not, not really. good for you. That sucks, man. Uh, Brooke, you're just jealous because he's gotten more successful than you somehow. He's got a way to cheat the system, and you want to cut corners just like him. But he's, he's 
cheating other struggling comics. Yeah, that's, that's what, what sucks. Mm-hmm. It's not like he's cheating some big system. He's like stealing off the backs of off people who can guy. barely feed themselves. Well, yeah. they should steal going... them back from him. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I have, I have a question. Is this, is this the mass speaker of the Brooke Complains Hour? What's oh, going on? oh, man, he is uh, a good I, I wow. know he stole that joke from Jeffrey. <laughs> <laughs> no, I didn't. No, I didn't. No, I didn't. <laughs> okay. He's good. All he's right. Good. Yeah. Well, you keep well, doing you, bud. Good, good luck. luck. Hopefully you don't get caught out there. And I don't know if he's going to get caught. I think karma gets him eventually. Yeah, yeah. Something that's like what we that. hope. The text in to 78592. If you have a confession you've been holding on to, we can hide your identity by masking your voice, and you can be on the next.